Hey dear, let us familiar about swine flu in detail now. Swine flu is also called to be swine influenza, pig influenza, hog flu and pig flu. Technically it is also called and known as H1N1 virus. It is an infection caused by any one of several types of swine influenza viruses. Transmission of the virus from pigs to humans is not a common and does not always change to human foo which results often only in the production of antibodies in the blood. If transmission causes human flu, it is called to be zoonotic swine flu. People with regular exposure to pigs are at increased risk of swine flu infection. Most of the symptoms of swine flu includes cough, fever, sore throat, stuffy or runny nose, body aches, headache, chills, fatigue. Top 10 Preventive Measures Number 1. Wash your hands frequently and thoroughly. Number 2. Cover your mouth and nose when you sneeze or cough. To avoid contamination of your hands, cough into a tissue or other handy cloth. Number 3. If one does have swine flu, it is transmitted to others starting about 24 hours before you develop symptoms and ending about 7 days later. Number 4. If you do have swine flu, H1N1 flu, you can give it to others starting about 24 hours before you develop symptoms and ending about SEVN days later. Number 5. If a member of your household has swine flu, designate only one household member to be responsible for the ill person's personal care. Number 6. Stand or prefer to be in hot places at least for some time on each day. Number 6. Take lemon water on daily basis especially in cooling seasons and or where there is risk of swine flu be infected. Is vaccine available for swine flu? Yes vaccines are available for swine flu. Few people do have allergy to eggs. The doubt is that can they take vaccines? Answer is yes. Even though vaccines have tiny amounts of egg proteins in them. Vaccines have tiny amounts of egg proteins in them and even flu vaccines that do have egg proteins and be given safely to most people with egg allergy. If you've had a reaction to eggs in the past, talk to your doctor before getting a flu vaccination. Your doctor may choose to give you the vaccine made without use of eggs or send you to a physician who specializes in allergies. Disclaimer. Information contained in this video is suggestive in nature. Viewers are advised to act at their discretion.